All right, so uh, how, do, how, do, how do we start this? Uh, I guess we pull park, press park. No, push down to dry. I, I do not know how to use this. My name's Trevor Joseph. You're watching Rolling Slow Media, and this is Nick's 992 GTS. My, my jacket matches your car. <laughs> Nick. Hi mate. Pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you so much for bringing down this absolutely gorgeous coloured 992. Um, yeah, I really want to know a lot about this car yeah. and your kind of story, your history, how did you end up with this car and what your car history is like, you know, yeah. because uh, you didn't just wake up and bang, <laughs> end up with a <laughs> lovely 992, did you? It's a special, it's a special one, this one. I had to yeah. wait a little while for the colour. Okay. Um, it's actually the third 992 I've had. So oh, I got right, a really, right. I got a really good deal on a cheap one. Yeah. Um, from a dealership up north, Preston. Um, and it was a year old. It was a really nice car, but it just some of the things on it, it lacked some of the, the stuff that yeah, I wanted. So yeah. I had that for a while, and I swapped that for something similar uh, that was in crayon. It was really nice with the aero kit, and um, it was tough to get PTS on the right. GTS in particular. So I had to wait for a little while. Yeah. Um, eventually picked this one up in March last year. Oh, okay. And really went to town with it with the spec. You know, it's got yeah. it's got most of the stuff on so there. You, that you'd so want. this was uh, new, your first yeah, yeah. first owner. Okay, so you yeah, yeah. literally specced it as Spect'd you want. It. What yeah, was the process it. like when it comes to specking a Good. new car? Because most of the people I speak to, their cars are you know 906s, 997s. They're yeah. quite they're quite old, but this is like the newest car that I've had on the yeah, channel. Yeah. So yeah, what was the yeah. the whole sort of experience like? There's certain options on them that you have to have. Yeah, like, things like sports exhaust. Sports chrono stuff, bits and bobs like that. That yeah. you're not going to sell it unless it has it. Yeah. Um, and then there are other bits and bobs which, depending on how you know carefully people are looking at, that they're definitely going to want on there. Yeah. Um, so with this one in particular, I tried to do it like quite a lightweight one. So it's got a carbon fibre roof, carbon fibre bucket seats. Yeah. It's sporty feel. It sounds a lot better inside yeah, because they okay. delete the back seats, so you can yeah. hear the you can hear the engine a lot better. It's almost like a GT3, isn't it? Like yeah. a light light Wish version. It was. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, no, it is. It is. Yeah. It's, 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 it, it, we're, we're trying to get there with it. Um, it looks good, and the colour's not for everyone, but you know, I like it. So, how does that painter sample work? You just walk into Porsche and say, "I want that colour," and they just basically yeah. try and match it or mix it. It's, you can either, um, I think when you do PTS, you can pick from a, the group. So there's like 600 colors that you can oh, choose okay. from. And I think you can also take a color in and they'll create it for you. I don't right. know if that's extra or whatnot, but yeah. Yeah. Ah, there's, a couple, there's a couple of greens I like. This is NATO Olive. Right. Um, it's one called Underberg, which is what, quite cool. There's yeah. a few, you know, you can go And through. so on the road, what's, because you, you've had several yeah. 992s. And uh, what were the ones you had before? Both Carrera S's. Right. This is a GTS. So what, what's, can you like tell the difference? What's, yeah. the, what's the feel like and sort of handling, accelerating, braking? This is much pointier. Yeah. Much, when you, remember the first week I picked it up when, we were, when I was driving it around, it's significantly pointier. The yeah. suspension's different and you can feel that. Engine, you can't really, you know, I think it's yeah. about 20, 30 brake more, but right, you can't right. really notice that. So more in sort of the handling and grip, yeah, you kind of really feel it. It's just a lot pointier. It's a lot more responsive. It's like the sensitivity's turned up. Um, yeah. yeah. And the GTS is four-wheel drive as well? No, no, you can get the four-wheel drive. Right, right. Yeah. Real Porsche fans have got to be real-wheel drive. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you taken it on the track or done any sort of this like one, no. no. This one, no. The last ones I did. Um, yeah. I haven't with this one. I will do. The tyres are nearly ready to be changed on this. Ah, OK. Right? So, in yeah. The spring, it might have. Send them off on a, on yeah. a track day. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> nice. Have you, like, like, been on any, like, road trips? So yeah, what's it like, done, sort of luggage? I mean, I know Porsches are great for, yeah. you know, because you've got the front and the back seats. Yeah. And, and you don't even have any back seats. No, no there's, there's room in there. Yeah, we've done yeah. a few bits and bobs. We've been out to Le Mans, been out to Spa. Yeah, yeah. 
It's mainly just for the kids, though, to be honest. Okay. Like driving them around. So where do they go? Where do they go if you've got well, no back seats? Kid. <laughs> <laughs> we've been, it's yeah. my, my daughter's a gymnast, so we've been to Paris a couple of times. Oh, nice. But yeah, it's nice. good. That's nice. And like, because you've got, the, you've got the, the sort of racing bucket seats, are they yeah. quite comfy for like those long journeys? Yeah, they are. I mean, yeah. I, the older generation Porsches, I think, are better tourers. Like, the 992 yeah. is a very bumpy car. Like, it's not. Yeah. You know, you've got to really love it, but, you know. I think any car that puts a smile on your face when you're driving it is what, what people want. So. Yeah. Um, does it have like a um, lift on it? Because of, I no, guess... I didn't put lift on this one. Uh, I didn't, and I probably should have done. Yeah. Um, but I've never really go anywhere that I have a problem with it. You okay. Know, I know some people do, but I've not. I've not had a problem with it with the lift on this. No. Yeah. Yeah. I guess like you don't really have too many speed bumps and no, stuff like that. Even yeah, though I take it slow, I mean, you, you've got to be. It's got to be a massive speed bump to cause yeah. a problem. The issue is normally like down ramps, petrol stations or something like that. You know, you, yeah. you, you be a bit careful, but no, I'm not having any problems. Because you had this from new, brand new, and yeah. you spec'd it at Porsche, since owning it, is there anything that you kind of wish you, that you didn't spec or things that you would spec or maybe mods that you would yeah. consider doing now that you, you know, you've, you've, you've yeah. had it a few It's difficult, I mean, months. With this one, no. This has got everything I want. I don't look at yeah. the, I don't look at the configurator and think oh, I wish I'd done that. This mm. one is exactly how I'd want it. Um, possibly, like you say, the lift, maybe. Yeah, yeah. And if I was to mod it, it'd probably be stuff in the interior. Um, JCR do some wicked seat like inlays you can put on those. Yeah, yeah. And they're they're known for their exhaust work as well. Um, uh, but you know, I don't know. Possibly further down the line, but yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, how long do you reckon you'll keep this before you? Not sure. Move I on? think I might move this one on soon. Yeah. Um, we'll see. And what, really what do you plan to, to get? Where, where do you go from here? <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I really like the GT4 RS. Oh, it's a wicked nice. car. I was talking to you about that off yeah. camera. It's a great car. Um, the GT3 engine in it. Yeah. I like, I like the look of that. Um, Would you not feel that that's maybe a little bit smaller and a bit more hardcore y yeah. for yeah. like. Your, did you daily this by the way? I, don't, I do and I don't. I mean, yeah. my, my daily going to and from work is a motorbike or a van. Oh, so, okay. you know, they're my kind of comfy cars. Yeah. Um, I don't drive these all the time. And to be honest, I love cars. I love driving. So every time I get in it, I don't care. Yeah. You know, if, it was yeah. In, if I had an F1 car, I'd, I'd take, I'd take <laughs> that to my <laughs> yeah, I, I couldn't care less. <laughs> Okay, so Nick has kindly given me the keys to his 992 GTS and has allowed me to take it for a spin. This is a first for the channel. I'm super excited. Like, no one's ever given me the keys to their car to drive before and no one's ever given me the keys to a 992 GTS. So, yeah, I'm really excited, guys. I hope this... Uh, uh, yeah, I hope you like what, what I'm about to film. This is totally spontaneous. I didn't plan to do this at all. Uh, I've got about five minutes. So yeah, I'm gonna take it for a drive and just tell you exactly what I think of this car. So yeah, I better just strap up. These seats are absolutely amazingly comfortable. I have to be honest with you. Like, uh, yeah, they super hug you. I think if you was definitely on track, if you was on track, you would never fall out of these. All right, so uh, how, how, do we, how do we start this? Uh, I guess we pull park, press park, no, push down to dry. I, I do not know how to use this. This is the first time I should really ask Nick to give me a little uh, tutorial, but uh, we'll figure it out. Okay, we're in drive. I hope I'm not in reverse. Um, are we in it in reverse? How do I know this handbrake's off? Okay, I don't know the handbrake's off. Uh, how do you go into to drive? Drive. Uh, that's reverse, sorry. Drive. Oh, that's it, we've done it, we're off, we're off. Okay, you figured it out, oh, hold on. There's a BMW coming. Wow, loving the Alcantara steering wheel. Okay, let's not get lost because uh, I need to find my way back here <laughs> to, to give Nick back his car. Wow, this feels really, really nice, really solid. I, 
I'm a little bit lost for words. Uh, okay, which way should we go? Uh, let's let's head. Let's head. Uh, let's head. No, let's go this way. Sorry, because I don't really want to go on a road that I won't be able to get back on. So we'll head along this country lane. Okay, my first impressions on this road. This car. Oh my god, I can't stop smiling. Literally, I cannot stop smiling. This feels so sick. It feels so solid. You know what it is? It's, I'm used to driving cars that are 15, 20 years old. Now you get into like a brand new car. There's no rattles, there's no clunks. There's nothing shaking around. It really just feels... Oh, listen to the exhaust. I, you know, I really want to put my foot down, but like, hey, it's not my car, B. It's a bit slippery. So yeah, I'm just going to cruise this one. Um, yeah, this feels, feels really, oh, this feels so cool. I so want one now, like he sold it to me. If Nick was a salesman, I'd be driving straight back with my checkbook, straight away. This feels so good. I, just, I love the exhaust note as well. You know what, I, I'm not gonna touch anything. Like, I'm so paranoid as well. This car's coming at me. I'm in someone else's car. It's a GTS 992. And yeah, I really don't want anything to happen on my first ever drive of a car. Uh, okay, which way should we go? Where are we at? Uh, all right, we'll turn left. Oh, got a little bit of wheel spin there. Okay, the road's gonna open up a bit, so we're, we could probably go a little bit faster, but still a speed limit. Yeah, also, I don't wanna lose my license. <laughs> yeah, this feels nice. Like, I honestly, like, I can see why people like crave for these cars, and this is the GTS. Just imagine what the gt 3 is like. That'd be nuts. This feels so good. It like, it just feels just nice and planted, you know? Okay, calm down, Trev, calm down. It ain't your car. It ain't your car. It's wet. We're on a slippery road. <laughs> calm down. This feels so nice. I really like the, in the infotainment system as well. Like, again, driving an old car, you really forget how much interiors have evolved over the years, you know? Like, I think to myself, oh, you know what? I'm going to buy myself a Pioneer head unit for the car, try and modernize it. But then you get in something like this and you're like, whoa, like look at the dials, look at the switches. Like this thing is like, it's as modern as modern can get, you know, it feels, it feels and it looks really great. Anyway, look, I need to keep my eyes on the road because I don't really want to crash. Um, but yeah, this feels nuts. Okay, I'm going to probably head to the next turning point and then I'm going to head back because A, I don't know where I am and B, I want to make sure I can get back his car in one piece. So yeah, this this does feel really nice. Let's try the let's try the paddles. Oh, I love the blip. That is nice. Okay, I need to find a place to turn around because 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 the further further away I go, the, the more I'm gonna forget where I came from. All right, maybe you can turn here. Actually, no, look. What's that? Is that a turning? Can I turn here? I think so. All right, let's turn around. Ah, not bad turning circle as well. I, honestly, I was expecting to have to do a three-point turn there. But literally, it just, it just looped quite nicely. All right, uh, is he letting me through? He's letting me go. All right, let's go back. Whoa! Did you hear that? I, you know what? I hope I'm catching the audio on this. Like, this was totally spontaneous. I did not plan to do this. I didn't plan to get in his car. So yeah, yeah. I hope, I hope you can hear the sounds, man. Maybe when I turn right back on. I hope I. T I hope it was right. Jesus Christ! I can't remember where I come from now. Oh, and I got my phone, so I'll have to. I'll have to give him a call uh, if I get lost. That is. But this feels so nice. Oh 
mate. Okay, I think I turned. Oh Jesus! Where? Which? Which way did I come? Uh, I think it was this right. Yeah, I think it was. Okay, dude, stay where you go. Stay where you are. Stay where you are. Whoa! Whoa! Just a little blip. You can feel the back twitch. You can feel the ABS kicking in, or ABS traction control, I should say, sorry, my bad. But wow, this feels so good. Did I even come down this road? I think I did. I swear it was this road. I swear it was this road. Uh, right, okay, all right. Oh, what else can I say? Um, yeah, this feels so good. This, uh, yeah, yeah, we did come down this road. Okay, national speed limit 60, so maybe I could uh, give it a little bit of a blast here, just a little bit. We're doing 30 at the moment, so let's, oh, look, there's a car coming. <sighs> God damn it. All right, when this car passes. Ooh, it just sounds so nice. It's this, it's got this nice, throatiness to it you know and then it just settles back down into being like a normal road car i think that's what i love about this like you could daily this every day and not feel like oh i'm driving a supercar like literally you could daily this thing all right uh okay which way did i come jesus oh, i don't know i can't remember i think it was this way i think so Ah, uh, was it? Was it? Uh, I think so. I don't know. Oh, that feels so nice and it sounds amazing. I th I, you know what? That's all I keep saying. It feels nice, sounds amazing. It feels nice, sounds amazing. It really does though. Okay. I am totally lost now. I swear down I didn't come this way. Literally. Or did I? Did I? I think I did. Ah, oh, pray down I did come this way. I swear, I, I, I know I passed those footballers. Did I come this way? I feel like I did. But I'm so like, I'm so immersed in driving this thing, like I couldn't, oh shit, now I'm lost. Oh, mate. I think it was this way. Oh, I'm gonna have to get my sat nav out. This feels so good. Okay, guys, I'm officially lost. Um, let me get the postcode of where we came from. back I don't really want to give this back though this feels so good all right what else what else can I say guys this has been a real pleasure like I've never driven a brand new Porsche before this is so cool like I so want one now like I mean I love my car to bits but this is like this is like next level newness this is like the new newness. You get me? Yeah, the feel, the seats. The, oh, these seats are so comfy. I would gladly do a road trip all the way to the south of France in this car. You would have so much fun. Oh my days. Ooh. Just giving it a blip, you can feel it. You can just feel the back just sort of turning. It's like, it's almost like it's moving the planet backwards so that you can go forward when it accelerates. And it's like, I love the sound of the whoosh. I know these cars are turbocharged now. 
and you can just hear the turbo just kind of spool and hear that nice whoosh sound. Like, dude, I'm, I, I, I don't know what I'm talking about. All I know is that this, this feels amazing. This feels so sick. Oh, I don't want to get back. Hopefully you can hear, let's wind this one down. You're going to hear the sound of the, the engine. Oh my god, this thing just wants to, it wants to throw you that way. <laughs> Literally, you can't, you can't push this on, on this wet road. You just have to, just chill. You gotta chill, man. Like you're saying. Okay, here we go. Here, we're here, we're here. We made it back in one piece. There's a few cars leaving. That's nice. Okay, everyone's thinking it's my car. Shall I, shall I pull into this like I, like I own the car? All right, come on, let's pull in like a, yeah, like this is my GTS. Hopefully people haven't seen it. And they're gonna be like, oh, who's this guy in a GTS? Okay, we're gonna, where, where should we stop? Wow, my last words, buy one. Buy one, buy one, buy one. Cash your pension in, sell your children's trust funds, sell a kidney, buy one. These things are absolutely sick. Right, how do I park this? Uh, park. Okay. Is it still in gear? I think, I think we're all good. Guys, this car is nuts. All right, look, look. I'm going to end the video here. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please don't forget to subscribe. And if you've got a car like this and you want me to drive it, just, just, just give me a shout. Do you like it? It's mine. <laughs> yeah, I bought it the other day. Yeah. <laughs>